Whoa, that's really pink. It's not just like a boring pink. It's like a paint pink. It's just there's a depth to it, which is really cool. It's hard to describe. I'm not even sure the camera captured that, but it's nice though. Is this our first super wrap? It is our first super wrap. Yes, it is. Why'd you say it like that? Because I've wrapped a super before. We don't talk about the past like that. <laughs> yes, hey, what? It is our first. Super not only is it our first time doing a super rep, it's our first time doing this color as well. Now we have the Supra on the jacks. We have it nice and clean. It's time for the wrap process to begin. First things first, we're gonna take off things that we need to take off, like maybe bumpers, trim pieces, things like that. That way we can wrap around very cleanly, hide any of the silver edges as much as possible. And the actual wrap will then be laid on top. Ooh! That's static though. That's static though. Ow! Bro, it got me in my toes. <laughs> What's up, guys? We're wrapping this 2021. 21, 22? We're wrapping this new Supra Cherry Blossom. The hood is 84 inches by 65. Probably one of the That's biggest good. hoods you could wrap. We're in a good hand. We got Sean over here. <laughs> Welcome back, guys, to another vlog. We're doing an intro right here? Yeah, sure. Are you white? Welcome back guys to another vlog. Prepping the front bumper to wrap it with this nose attack. When it comes to doing pink wraps, I'm usually hesitant about it just because I've seen a lot of them online. It's typically the wrong shade of pink with the wrong brand on the wrong car, so it doesn't really work. Now, I might be a little biased here, but the setup we have here is one of the very few times I see a pink car that looks incredible, and here's why. The Supra does have some aggressive body lines, but the majority of it is pretty soft and round. The rear fenders, the roof lines, and even the way the hood lines slope down into the bumper, it's predominantly softer lines, so it's a great base for a pink wrap, especially this one, because it's a soft pink. And Notes Tech calls it cherry blossom for a reason. It's not bright like chrome, but it's not dull and matte. It's a nice, simple gloss finish that looks very paint-like, and I can't say that enough because a lot of times when pink wraps don't work on a car, it's because it looks like a wrap. The biggest compliment you can give a wrap is that it doesn't look like a wrap. It sounds counterintuitive, but that's the best thing about this. It's just not an overdone pink with a bunch of metallic flakes. It's simple but done right. And I like doing close-ups on our wraps because a lot of installers don't like to show them and that's why most pictures online are six feet away where you really can't see anything or understand what kind of quality work is being put out. For example, here's a close-up on the front bumper. Typically there's seams in this region so it's visible head-on, but with this Supra, that isn't the case. Most people probably wouldn't notice the seams anyway, but to the discerning eye, now they really appreciate not seeing the seams. Give me your take on the pink Supra. What do you think? It made Sean question his sexuality. Was that good? I give it five starfish. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> <laughs> that is it for the vlog. Hope you like that pink Supra that we wrapped. If you want to wrap your car, hit us up. Our kind of info is in the description. Down below, we 